Albany is one step closer to getting a Dunkin' Donuts now that Albany City Commissioners have agreed to rezone the area to allow for a drive through To ensure it won't cause issues for nearby residents, commissioners asked for a sound study and for curbs to block off a nearby, a, a, a nearby alleyway. Later in the same meeting, the board also voted to use around $250,000 in SPLOS funds to build a storage facility for the Albany Fire Department. When they have a big exercise, they have to go to eight different fire stations to prepare. So this will give them a central point where they can keep all their extra gear and special training tools and stuff in, a, in one location to make it easier for them to access it. Uh, Merck donated $1,000 towards the building expected to be completed in the spring, and Public Works and City Engineering employees are also helping in any way they can to cut costs.